China originally 100 years ago. Then we actually changed to a slightly different way. Mom actually make the, uh, the all the mixture, and then our kids actually start making the uh, um, you know fold the, it into the uh, the the, uh, the shapes. Um, it's kind of interesting. You know, I mean, playful sort of. You know, um, at the kitchen. Then we start cook and eat, enjoy eating. So now it's time to go into details to make a beautiful Japanese gyoza. <laughs> First of all, we cut the um, cabbage in a finely chop. I love the Japanese uh, technique of cutting, you know. The, in Japan, cutting is very important. In every dish you guys prepare, the cutting technique is very, very important. After finely chop, you put in the bowl. I'm in Tokyo right now. Yep. Yeah. So you put a bit of salt on the top of the cabbage and mix, mix, mix. And leave for the two minutes. This is Nila, the Chinese garlic chai. Yes, that's the next one to cut. Chop, chop, chop. Now we have to squeeze the water out from the cabbage. So grab this one and squeeze. And put in another bowl. Yep. Great teamwork. Yep. <laughs> squeeze the water out. So now I'm going to mix all ingredients. Meat and cabbage and garlic chive and all seasoning. Uh, seasoning Ooh. is a soy sauce, salt, pepper, and sesame oil. Okay, this is the pork mince. Put in a bowl. You put all cabbage inside. You chop chop. Garlic chive. Garlic cube to be grained. Grated garlic. Great. 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 Just a little bit of in ginger. Ginger. Now it's a salt and pepper. Salt. This is a Japanese soy sauce. Just put on like this. This is a sesame oil, giving a flavor. Mm -hmm. Next, we're gonna add this um, Japanese uh, the flavor, the cooking sake, which is called the mirin. Now we have to mix all together. And we're gonna add a bit more of oh, Nina, yeah. uh, Chinese, uh, what is that again? Garlic, Garlic chives. chives. Oh. Is that enough? Yes. Ah, is that enough? Yes. <laughs> My hand is getting tired now. <laughs> I'm so hungry now. Can I eat now? <laughs> then it has to wait for 10 to 15 minutes. Okay, leave it for we'll Give the flavors to the meat, yes, alright? That's right. yes. Nice watch, Mika. Hold it. Oh, nice watch. <laughs> we are going to make a dip sauce. Dip sauce. Dip what sauce. are we using for the dipping sauce? Is white vinegar. And now it's a soy sauce. So this is a layu. Give me the flavor. We have to make a gyoza. Now mix well. Mixing well. Yay! Yay! So now we're going to wrap the Mixture to the pastry. So, so take that one, one pastry, pastry or whatever it's called. Yeah. And, and then use the spoon. 
put in the middle. Now you put water half and fold in half, and then you gather this one. I can see the dough is thinner than the Chinese dumplings. That's right. Mm. And just middle, yes. The middle? Yep. Now I get a little bit of water. Yes, that's right. And now the middle part. Okay. Okay. And now this is the now, dish. It's not like a ravioli, you have to make it that's right. So in the middle. My grandmother will say, what are you making? That, you don't yeah. make ravioli that way. No, 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 it's not ravioli. It's um, <laughs> Japanese ravioli. <laughs> doesn't look as nice as yours, but it's okay. okay. It's good. Made gyoza. My first gyoza ever. Show me. Look at that, look at that. <laughs> you think your mom will approve it? Yeah, yeah that's okay. Oh, look this at is my gyoza. Uh, look, look at the difference. <laughs> what did we say? <laughs> look at the difference. It's like gyoza, Italian and Japanese. <laughs> No, the good looking one and the ugly one. <laughs> so now we are going to cook fried gyoza. So we're going to put vegetable oil in the pan. We're going to cook this one. One, two, three, four, five. Maybe about this much. Okay, we have to put the lid on the top. Now we're going to steam the gyoza. How long do we cook the gyoza for? Maybe two minutes. So we can open the lid. <laughs> no, you have to be patient. <laughs> so after two minutes, you put the water. Yep, yeah, put the water. Mm. You can open Ta-da! don't eat just that. We have some different sort of portions like a rice, cooked rice and then soup and then this would be the main sort of you know the sort of main dish. Main dish mm -hmm. and then some sort of small sort of. But now guys we're almost ready to eat. Yeah. I want to say a big thank you to Yumi, to Mika. Thank you very much. Arigato very much for showing our friends how to cook a real Japanese gyoza. These beautiful ladies deserve a big like. <laughs> And now, guys, it's time to eat, so we say the Italian version first. E ora si mangia! Vincenzo stay and friends! But to our friends, we have to say it also in Japanese. How do we say in Japanese? Itadakimasu! Vincenzo's plate and... Friends! How do you say in Japanese, friends? Tomodachi! Tomodachi, Vincenzo's plate. <laughs> bye bye, guys, bye bye! Itadakimasu! Ladies, we have a feast, a Japanese feast now. Gyoza. Mm. We made some extra gyoza. Then we have um, quickly made yes. miso soup. So let's start eating. Yes. So what do we do before we eat the gyoza? Do we actually dip it in, mm. in the sauce? Yeah. Let's go. Mm.